pwn clearing drill. All right. And our coaching points here are going to be on the shot. We want to, everyone needs to get to a cone on the field. All right. This is going to teach us our spacing. All right. We want to see the ball at all times. We want to come back to the ball on the clear. If there's a teammate ahead of you, we want to pass him the ball. If there's nobody ahead of you, we want to run the ball out over the midfield line. Remember when the ball gets clear, we need three over the line and three back at all times. And everybody's going to play all positions in this drill, including attackmen. Okay, everybody needs to know where the defensemen go in the clear, where the middies go, um, and the attackmen are going to come in and play those positions as well. Our rotation will be our defensemen will go to midi, middies will come out, and the players who are off the field will come in as defensemen. Okay, so before we get this drill going, all right, we have to set cones up throughout the field where we need our players to get to, which is to keep our spacing. Okay, so the first thing we're going to do is we're going to have two cones right outside each restraining line on the left and right side of the goal, about goal line extended. We'll have two cones right directly inside the restraining box, okay, about 10 yards apart. And we will have two cones right about at the intersection of the wing lines, okay, on each side staying on side of the field, fully in the net. We'll have a coach who will have a ball and will take a shot at the goalie. All right, goalie will catch it. We will get a defenseman to this cone, a defenseman to this cone, the other defenseman to the box, and we will get our middies to fill these last three cones. Again, like we said, we break to these spots. We want our middies seeing the ball at all times. We don't want to turn our back and run all the way up the field because we might be open and the goalie might see us. At that point, the goalie will pick a player, one of these two defensemen, or one of these middies to give the ball to. If he gives it to one of these defensemen, remember our rule is we want to throw the ball to a player if he's in front of you. So in this case, this defenseman has the ball in the corner. We have a midi right here who is in front of him. He will break to get the ball. This midi will turn, he will have a defenseman in front of him, and he will give him the ball, and we'll run it over the line. So our rules are, again, the player's in front of you, we want to pass it up the field to that player. If there's nobody in front of you, we want you to run the ball over the midfield line. Remember, if a defenseman brings it over, we need a midfielder to stay back, all right? And we can get three guys over the line, and we have to have three guys back at all times.